Thank you very much, uh, Mr. Moderator. Uh, I'm terribly the honored to say very briefly, because uh, in my capacity as uh, chair of G8 this year, and also successfully organizing uh, Tokyo International Conference African Development uh, just uh, last week, issue that uh, we are confronting today as I mean, one of the priority issues. Just want to say a few words on this, that uh, it's very clear that uh, the, we do have a very long history of combating uh, tuberculosis and successfully controlling the prevalence. And uh, this issue of HIV-related tuberculosis and multi-drug resistance TB is a very, very serious one. And the issue you are talking about is that integrated approach and also community health approach is extremely key. And we are very pleased that uh, success story so far already we have heard and good practice uh, can be enumerated in many places. After all, we can share the information and uh, experiences. We strongly support effort of every stakeholder in the international community, from government, private sector, civil society and individual, to work together to tackle HIV TB. It's very clear there are two things we need to combating HIV TB effectively. First, mobilize political commitment and more resources. Second, promote sharing of technical knowledge and technical support through multilateral and bilateral channel. The Global Fund has been launched in the last time when G8 Summit took place in Japan, Okinawa. And I'm very pleased, personally, I participated in the launching, made a significant contribution. And it's very important to emphasize that uh, TV, HIV-related TV get a lot of support from Global Fund. In fact, two-thirds of uh, the old international assistance devoted to combat TB comes from Global Fund. So therefore, it is important the Global Fund will get continuous strong support. And Japan made additional $560 million support to Global Fund just recently. Equally important support has to be strengthen health system and community health care, as First Lady of Rwanda mentioned, in developing countries, and particularly to train but not only train, but retain the health expert is an urgent challenge, together with improving maternal and child health. And TCAD 4, which took place last week, just talked about this issue and emphasized the importance of human resources and health workers and adopted specific action plan for the next five years. We're very much looking forward, looking forward effective implementation of action plan. We will also give high priority on this issue in forthcoming G8 summit in Toyako, Hokkaido, early next week. The issue is getting high priority. And we are committed to achieve goal to half, to reduce by half, deaths of people with HIV TB annually by 2015. Thank you very much for the opportunity. Thank you.